If you are a VLSI aspirant and want to know about free tools that can help you to learn basics of VLSI flow, keep watching this video till the end. We all are very familiar with Mozilla Firefox. It's a free web browser. Free softwares are available in every domain. There are so many EDA VLSI free tools that can help you to learn basics of the flow. Many of such tools are very popular for years among VLSI aspirants and industry freshers. We have listed such 15 tools. Today, we will discuss about those tools and their key features. VLSI design is a serious business and if you are wondering whether free tools can help you to learn it, answer is a big yes. They are real good to start your learning. Dedicated team of developers are behind such tools. They work real hard to keep their tools up to date. These free tools are feature packed and also have regular releases like their commercial counterpart. Commercial tools are high on accuracy and efficiency as per industry standard and of course comes with a huge price tag for license. They need desktop or laptop with cost high-end configuration to run. Affording such setup and license is impossible for a student. On the other hand, free tools will cost you nothing. Support regular home PC or laptop configuration. Support different OS. Loaded with updated features, user manual are available. There are forums where you can ask questions and discuss issues related to the tool. In VLSI software world, the cost of a tool is the cost of its license. Now, if the license cost is zero, the tool becomes free of cost. GNU GPL serve this purpose. General public license that is GNU GPL or simply GPL is a series of widely used free software licenses that that guarantee end users the four freedoms to run, study, share and modify the software. In today's episode, we will cover both free tools and open source tools. Download links of all the tools covered in today's episode are mentioned in the description box of the video. First tool is Icarus Verilog. Icarus Verilog is a Verilog simulation and synthesis tool. It operates as a compiler compiling source code written in Verilog IEEE 136 into some target format. It's a command line tool, so you have to use it from command prompt. The simulator can do batch simulations. The main compiler is written by Stephen Williams. Icarus Verilog is a work in progress and new versions releases time to time. There is also a test suite available with the simulator. Second tool is GHDL. GHDL is an open source simulator for the VHDL language. It's a command line tool, so you have to use it from command prompt. GHDL HDL fully supports the 1987, 1993, 2002 versions of the IEEE 1076 VHDL standard. GHDL uses a code generator and is much faster than any interpreted simulator. GHDL runs on Linux, Windows and Apple OS X. You can freely download a binary distribution for your OS or try to compile GHDL on your own. Vivado Vivado Design Suite is a software suite produced by Xilinx for synthesis and analysis of hardware description language designs. It has a graphical user interface so you can run it like any Windows software. It has superseded Xilinx IAC with additional features for system on a chip development and high level synthesis. Vivado represents a ground up rewrite and rethinking of the entire design flow compared to IAC. Vivado includes the inbuilt logic simulator. Vivado also introduces high level synthesis with a tool chain that converts C code into programmable logic. Next tool is LT Spice. LT Spice is high performance Spice simulator software. It has a graphical user interface so you can run it like any Windows software. It has a graphical schematic capture interface. Schematics can be probed to produce simulation results. LT Spice's enhancements and model improve the simulation of analog circuits when compared to other Spice solutions. Supported across all OS, instructional videos, tips and articles are available. LT Spice forum in engineer zone is there to ask your query and questions. 
Next tool in the list is NGSPICE. NGSPICE is the open source SPICE simulator for electric and electronic circuits. It's a command line tool so you have to use it from command prompt. NGSPICE supports digital circuit simulation, single and complex simulation and mixed signal circuit. NGSPICE offers a wealth of device models for active, passive, analog and digital elements. User can add his circuits as a netlist and the output is one or more graphs of currents, voltages and other electrical quantities or is saved in a data file. Third party interface is available. NGSPICE is PSPICE or LTSPICE compatible. NGSPICE also read HSPICE device libraries from semiconductor foundry PDKs for simulating integrated circuits. NGSPICE builds on many operating systems like Windows, Mac OS, all popular Linux distributions, SIGWIN or FreeBSD. The FAQ and documentation pages provide a lot of information, a detailed manual is available, mailing list, discussion forums and a bug tracker are offered. Next come GTK Wave. GTK Wave is a VCD waveform viewer based on the GTK library. This viewer supports VCD and LXT formats for signal dumps. Supports different OS like Unix, Win32 and Mac OS X which reads LXT, LXT2, VZT, FST and GHW files as well as standard Verilog, VCD and eVCD files and allows their viewing. Documentation in PDF format is available. For SVN access to the experimental pre-release source tree link is on SourceForge website. GTK Wave is a simple lightweight application. It is based on George Moody's original Wave for Unix. The Wave user's guide is the primary documentation for GTK Wave. The program is designed to help the IC designer view the signal transitions on the established timeline as well as the interaction of signals from different designs. It can easily read and translate the hardware description language in waveforms. GTK Wave features a GUI but for users who work faster in command line the program can also be thus controlled. You can run the help command to view all the supported arguments. Next is Open Timer. Open Timer is a static timing analysis tool to help IC designers quickly verify the circuit timing. It's a command line tool so you have to use it from command prompt. It is developed completely from the ground up using C++ 17. The tool efficiently support parallel and incremental timing. Key features are supports industry standard format like .lib, .v, .spef, .sdc, provide graph and path based timing analysis, supports parallel incremental timing for first timing closure. Open Timer has a unix software architecture to efficiently enable parallel and incremental timing. Next is Magic Layout. Magic is a VLSI layout tool written in the 1980s at Barclay. Magic has remained popular with universities and small companies largely due to its liberal Barclay open source license. It has a graphical user interface so you can run it like any Windows software. Magic is widely cited as being the easiest tool to use for circuit layout design. Even for people who ultimately rely on commercial tools for their product design flow. Magic features real-time design rule checking. Magic currently runs under Linux although versions exist for DOS, OS2 and other operating system. Magic is frequently used in conjunction with IRSIM3 and other simulation programs. Next is TKGate. TKGate is an event-driven digital circuit simulator with TKLTK based graphical editor. It has a graphical user interface so you can run it like any Windows software. TKGate supports a wide range of primitive circuit elements as well as user defined modules for hierarchical design. The distribution comes with a number of tutorial and example circuits which can be loaded through the help menu. TKGET is free software provided with source code under the GNU GPL. QCS QCS stands for Quite Universal Circuit Simulator. QCS is a free software released under GPL. It has a graphical user interface so you can run it like any Windows software. It offers the ability to set up a circuit with a graphical user interface and simulate the large signal, small signal and the noise behavior of the circuit. QCS supports a growing list of analog and digital components as well as SPICE sub-circuits. 
Some versions of QCS can simulate Verilog A. The QCS GUI is well advanced and allows setting up schematics and presenting simulation results in various types of diagrams. DCAC as parameter noise and transient analysis is possible. Mathematical equations and use of circuit hierarchy are available. QCS comes with an array of components and models. Third party models, including HICOM, BSIM 2, BSIM 3, BSIM 6, can be compiled and loaded into the simulator. QCS is currently developed under the GNU Linux OS. Variant of QCS are available on Windows and Mac OS. QCS is released under the GPL license. Next tool is eSIM. eSIM is a free or libre and open source EDA tool for circuit design, simulation, analysis and PCB design. It is an integrated tool built using free or libre and open source software such as KiCad, NGSpice, Verilator, Makerchip and GHDL. eSIM is released under GPL. This tool was previously known as OSCAD or FreeEDA. It has a graphical user interface so you can run it like any Windows software. eSIM offers similar capabilities and easy of use as any equivalent proprietary software for schematic creation, simulation and PCB design. Features of the tool are draw circuit using KiCad, create a netlist and simulate using NGSpice. Design PCB layouts and generate Garber files using KiCad. Add or edit device model that is Spice models and sub circuits using the model builder and sub circuit builder tools. Perform mixed signal simulation. Supports for Ubuntu and Windows OS. Next tool is Electric. Electric VLSI design system is an open source IC design tool. The tool is written in Java. Electric is a sophisticated electrical CAD system that can handle many forms of circuit design, including custom IC, layout, schematic drawing, hardware description language specification, and electromechanical hybrid layout. This is a very good tool from academic point of view where we mostly need to build a circuit for learning purpose. Electric can also handle VHDL and Verilog. It has several analysis and synthesis tools like design rule checking, simulation, routing, layout versus schematic, logical effort, etc. Runs on all major operating system. Licensed under GNU GPL. Next is GNU Octave. GNU Octave is a high-level programming language intended for scientific computing and numerical computation. Octave helps in solving linear and nonlinear problems numerically. It may also be used as a batch-oriented language. It is free software under the terms of GNU General Public License. Powerful mathematics-oriented syntax with built-in 2D or 3D plotting and visualization tools. Runs on GNU, Linux, Mac OS, BSD and Microsoft Windows. OpenRoad. The OpenRoad project was launched in June 2018 within the DRPA IDEA program. OpenRoad aims to bring down the barriers of cost, expertise and unpredictability that currently block designers' access to hardware implementation in advanced technologies. The project team is developing a fully autonomous open source tool chain for digital SOC layout generation focusing on the RTL to GDS to phase of system on chip design. The OpenRoad project has two releases. One application. The application is a standalone binary capable of performing RTL to GDS to SOC design from logic synthesis and floor planning through detailed routing with metal fill insertion sign off, parasitic extraction and timing analysis. And the second one is flow. Open road flow is a full RTL to GDS flow built entirely on open source tools. The project aims for automated no human in the loop digital circuit design with 24 hour turnaround time. For system requirements and supported file formats, please check the documentation. Well, these are the list of the tools and hope today's discussion will help you. Let us know which tool you are planning to use or already you have used. We have already covered Vivado, Icarus Verilog, OpenTimer, GTK Wave in our channel. Tutorial series are there on these tools. Watch tutorial videos, learn the tool, enjoy the journey and the learning process. That much for today. Stay tuned, stay focused.